I want to talk about tough conversations. There are times when I have to have tough conversations with people. What does one of those tough conversations look like? Hey, you're not making it here. I know you can do better. You're not stepping up. We need you to do better. It is okay to have a tough conversation with somebody. It is not going to be insulting. It's not going to be derogatory. We're not going to call you stupid. We're not going to say any of those things. But it's okay to have a tough conversation. So we're going to role play a scenario where I am afraid to have a tough conversation, okay? Hey, buddy. No, 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 no. Hey, buddy. buddy. No, 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 no. Hey, no, 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 no. I don't want to Listen, hear did that non-tough conversation work? Not at all, right? No. Coach doesn't do that. Coach says, listen, snap out of it. Get your butt back in the game and do what you can do. I do what I taught you to do. Knock it off, right? That's what they do, right? Just like an athlete may get in their own head and not perform well, we can all get in our own head and not perform. So I want you to understand, all of us, we're not perfect at any of this, right? No one is perfect, but I want you to believe and understand that if we have a tough conversation with you, it is just to get you to do the best you can do and be the best version of yourself because we got to get you to get out of your own head sometimes. And that's what that's about. So it's not comfortable. I know. I know it's not. Listen, my wife has tough conversations with me, right? It's true. Like, I, she, I, we go home and she's like, you did not do that well. You did not do that well. You did not do that. You need to do this and this and this. And she's right. And you know who else I have tough conversations with? The pastor from my church. Why do I love him? Because he's able to have a tough conversation with me.